Hello there, we are going today to play a new game. It's called Benny's Forest. I discovered it while reading this very, very interesting paper. Uh, it's about the challenge of uh, deforestation and reforestation. Uh, so the idea is to put ourselves in the shoes of a project manager and go through different actions to uh, learn about how we can sustainably reforest uh, a, a jungle in uh, Indonesia. So the link of the game is here. We're going to play this game today and investigate its um, interface, mechanics and dynamics. Before saying that, I would like to just say that this game was implemented using Babylon.js webpack and typescript uh, so that's why you saw a b at the beginning uh, so let's see how to start the game okay yeah so it also comes with a nice calming music uh, we have three levels fire chance prosperity biodiversity our exit tutorial go to the next year and manpower remaining plus different uh, types of species fire ditch empty ground and fertilized grounds as actions here you can find how biodiverse the forest is and how much prosperity it brings for the local community the most prosperous the forest is the less likely the villagers are to illegally cut down trees the end goal of the game is to have as high of a biodiversity score as possible before 10 years passes pass uh, so just to mention that this is the first time i'm playing this game so i'm quite exploring it as i'm recording this video this is the action bar. With these actions, you can improve the rainforest. Most over each action to see description. Yes, yeah, so we have different uh, trees and they have different biodiversity and fertility score. Uh, how much manpower it costs, which aspect of the forest it improves. The total amount of manpower is shown in the bar below. Mm. Okay, so we can see that does not catch fire quickly interesting and it cost eight um so i think eight it should be eight, eight manpower not yeah eight manpower cool um here you can see the current year the bottom go to the next turn advances the year by one this will give you access to the new manpower okay so now okay i think we exit tutorial and we play can can we put this here no i think like this is our region of interest and actually like i'm trying to move around but i can't so yeah uh let's see uh so we are in 2023 we need to reforest and some of them has fertility some of them have prosperity and fertility no, the, so it's just fertility for legumes uh, and prosperity for sugar palm, fruit tree, and native tree. Um, wow, it's so interesting. Um, I would say that at since this was a land before a community, then I would go for native land. You can only plant trees on the clear ground. So, can I do it here? So, where? Um, oh, maybe I have to actually... Oh, okay, so I could not actually plant tree because uh, the land was not clear. So, I have to empty the land. Uh, interesting. Okay, empty. Let's say empty some small land. Uh, and... Um, plant some trees in the yeah here uh, fertilizer I, I don't know what happens cannot okay so we have to okay we have to fertile the land before we 
plant so where i'm going to plant the tree is uh mm, well I, I have not much remaining um so what i'm going to do is i'm going to maybe plant the uh, the, the forest here and i'm going to maybe um, one and i think i don't have much remain so my first maybe comment is that i wish there could have been like uh, an indicator of how much uh, or how many units of manpower has remained because now i'm kind of completely going blind mm. but i would say that um I, I would go for random fertilizer here or oh, maybe i have more no so not enough manpower required uh, I would say from what I read from the paper now we have to go to the next year so events this year some trees have died due to being planted on low fertility soil wow that's so sad <laughs> uh, but very interesting approach I liked it um, okay so we have extra manpower maybe we have to uh, mm, try to fertilize the land uh, I will try to maybe do it just super random I'm not sure what why I'm doing this. Uh, okay, a little bit of idea because I think maybe if we plant um, fruit tree uh, in the in the, in the skirt of uh, a land, it would be more accessible for um, whoever is going to pick those fruits, maybe citizens uh, or the community. Uh, and I would keep maybe. Um, can we do this? Yeah. Can we just like, uh, oh, we can add fertilizer uh, here. Okay. Interesting. Can I win the tr okay. Um, yeah, so now we're going to add some fruit. And I don't, I don't know if we can do this. No. Can we do, the, can we do anything? Yes. Next area, let's see. Events this year. Some trees have died due to being planted on low fertility soil. So, even though I. Yeah, so probably we have to. Uh, maybe I have to put fer fertilizer before uh, digging the ground. Let's see this here if we can do better. So, let's do this. So two years into our program and not much achieved. Uh, so and now I would like to plant uh, maybe more fruit and, and also some um, fire resistance. Um, okay, and legumes. This bush will slowly increase in the fertility around it. Oh, this is so nice. It can live with low fertility. It quickly catches fire. Let me see. Okay, we're eight minutes in. Um, yeah, I will probably like do this, and maybe I can just yeah. Let's go to the next year. Some trees have died due to being planted on low fertility soil. So those were the soils that I planted before I uh, give them fertilizer. And I can see that biodiversity is has not grown that much, prosperity not. Um, so let's increase maybe the biodiversity this year. Um, native bush, random here, and biodiversity. Uh, we have to dig. Can we? Yeah. Okay, um, so let's, uh, I, I don't know if my fertilizer, yeah, oh my god, fertilizer went away. <laughs> okay, uh, so let's say biodiversity, this is the fruit, biodiversity, and fertility. I will go for this a little bit. Oh. Maybe like this and like this. 
like this and like this. Not enough manpower remaining. I don't know if we can like uh, put this manpower to the next year. Some tears have died due to being planted on low fertility. Grass has grown back on the neglected areas. Oh, oh. So if we if we dig and we don't um, plant, then we cannot use it. Interesting. Uh, so let's um, let's. Okay, so let's just focus on our uh, empty space. I don't know if we can do something here. Okay, so this is a ditch, so maybe we try to like uh, randomly do this. Mm, what I like to do... I, can I go back? No. Uh, oh, interesting. So the fire chance is increasing. Uh, so what I would do is to create like a line, so the fire cannot easily just go or spread. Um, and uh, in the remaining land, I will plant some trees. Uh, plant can what uh, can only plant trees on clear ground. Oh, I hadn't cleared the ground. So let's add fertilizer here and here. Oh, so even the land the color changes, but I didn't notice. I I, I guessed, but I didn't quite understood. So. Okay, so we don't have enough and instead we can maybe continue with our um, So locals have collected wood due to the low prosperity of the forest. Oh the, Some trees have died due to being planted on low fertility soil Grass has grown back on neglected area. Oh, okay. I can see that they um so what I like to do is to complete my, let's say, fire line so the fire doesn't spread over different areas. But maybe we can increase the prosperity first. Uh, so this is biodiversity and prosperity and this is biodiversity. So I will add maybe more biodiversity. Um, And I will first give them fertilizer. Two fertilizers. Because I'm generous. <laughs> um, oh, not enough actions. Let's see. A fire, uh, a fire has devastated parts of the forest. Locals have collected wood to the low prosperity of the forest. Some trees have died due to being planted on low fertility soil. Um, I'm having a little bit of issue of uh, how to approach this because I feel like I'm, I'm trying um, and I'm not sure um, what to do maybe we can have a have some like a little bit of land here let's see prosperity one so I think the main issue is that now they don't feel really prosper and that's why they try to um, cut trees and um, yeah maybe um, Okay. Some trees have died due to being planted on low fertility land. Uh, grass has grown back on neglected areas. Okay, uh, so we continue. We add some fertilizer. Um, so let's let's take the prosperity a little bit higher, and. Um, And also 
add some trees uh, that that help with biodiversity randomly so maybe that's how we should do it um, then let's add uh, fruit and let's add this um, oh. and okay years remaining too mm, locals have collected wood due to the low prosperity of the forest some trees have died and grass has grown back uh, I think we hopefully we're doing well here oh, we have the fire line we have this okay, this okay we can plant back and I, I think maybe we can also try to um, work on prosperity fertility there we don't have any of this yes good mm. Biodiversity, by diversity, by diversity, fire resistance. Mm. Maybe add some here, and um, I think I don't know if we can do anything here. Okay, let's add this one. See how how it would do, and um, let's add. This one we can uh, cost eight. Okay, this is by diversity, and we're working on prosperity. So maybe this one. This one. Oof. Uh, okay. Oh, good. Look. Uh, it changed the landscape. Locals have collected wood due to the low prosperity. Mm, okay, so we are playing for 70 minutes. Um, Thirty percent chance of fire. Okay, what to do? Um, so um, let's dig some ditches here and fertilize them. And we need to maximize the prosperity and biodiversity at the same time. So I will go low for this. Uh, I will go maybe here and here. And I think I'm going to continue like a um, like three of them together, trying to like use it in every tree tree area. Oh, so let's do this. Uh, did. Okay. Oh, thank you for playing. Your forest has little value for the local community. This means there is a chance that locals will cut down some parts of the forest. The diversity of your forest is low. This means that there are many species of animals inhabiting the forest. There are not many. It captures uh, around uh, 86 tons of CO2 per year, which is nice, but it could be more. Please have a look at the Masarang uh, Foundation, which is actively restoring rainforests in India. Finally, please help us. So, uh, yeah, for it was... Oh. It was uh, very, very interesting, uh, really interesting. Um, I like the uh, dynamics. Uh, I kind of like this, um, let's say, constraint on resources. Uh, what I found it difficult, I, I, I'm going to play as I'm going to talk. What I, what I found it difficult uh, was that like now that the game is finished, um oh now that the game is finished um i don't know what is a good action to do um uh, like i wish i had i could have received some sort of 
guideline to avoid next time that I'm going to play. Uh, uh, I, I like the far, fire chance, uh, but I think it made me worried, so I used my resources otherwise. Um, let me see. Okay, so I have more by the river city this time. Um, what else? Uh, yeah, I, I think I, I hope there could have been like uh, like now it, it I, I don't know like what are the best practices in forestation for example should I have planted only sugar palm one year and then other trees another year or should I like give like should I try to plant uh, all of them in the same year uh, should I plant something earlier and something later or uh, should I like like literally how should I do it um, I also for example I'm not oh, I'm not clear about these legumes uh, because um, it says that it, it, it helps with the fertility of the land and we could see that it helped uh, really with the fertility of the land that was under fire but I don't know if this um, land is uh like does it help with the other trees or not uh so this time i'm doing a little bit better <laughs> but still you can see that like being planted on low fertility so <coughs> excuse me but even though this like, like even though this time and last time i gave them fertilizers uh, i could not have um reforested uh i like that we have to kind of take the trunks that uh, are dead out uh, and replant. I really like this action, but what I think I couldn't understand is that like you can't fertilize the land, so kind of you cannot cover up for the actions that you did. You have to wait for the event to happen to you, uh, and yeah, if you just like give them two times fertility, I don't know if it's good or bad. Um, what else mostly mostly i think i like to to have a uh, understanding of my own performance in the end uh, more than by diversity prosperity and fire chance i like to know what should i do or, or what should i have done um uh, uh the music was bothering me at some point because i was feeling that i'm losing <laughs> uh, so I, I i wanted to have more concentration um the plant with like, like the lo the issues with the locals and the prosperity uh, so for example they they i don't know if like they, they say that the prosperity is low so they come and um try to steal some wood or illegal logging but what i don't know is that we have fruit tree uh, that has economic uh, value uh what happens if i don't plant any fruit tree will they starve these are like some of the questions that maybe I like to to ask if I had the chance. Oh, I just saw that the trees the the trees they they grew a little bit. Some trees have died due to being planted on low fertility land here. Uh, so basically, fertility is not enough as long as it's it's maybe twice the amount. Um, let's do some fire and um, I would say that I learned definitely uh, but I have some open questions in my mind and yeah it was like really really interesting game I really enjoyed it it was a little bit maybe too long for me as a person <laughs> who was not doing this in her free time uh, but i think it, it it was worth it i i liked it in general yeah so thank you to you for watching and thank you to the game designers for designing this i think most probably i uh, quite most probably i will go and play this uh, a little bit more and and see uh, what would be yeah, the outcomes See you in the next video. A few moments later.
I'm kind of still playing the game and I think this time I'm having much more success with this game. Uh, none of my trees got fired. Uh, by fire, <laughs> they didn't. They didn't. <laughs> they didn't lose their job. But I mean, like they they they, they weren't attacked by any fire. This land was completely protected. Um, so now I'm going to uh, do it like here and maybe here. And I'm going to add two fertilizers to each one and uh, add biodiversity. Um, Oh, wait, that was a mistake. Okay, uh, so we can add maybe prosperity here. Here, um, so these lands they have some fertilizers, and also this one. So what I'm going to do is adding some means for prosperity and biodiversity both. So maybe I focus more on this uh, fruit tree. And let's see. Okay. And some trees died due to being planted on low fertility land. Okay. Oh, these ones. Not good. Not good. Uh, but we can add some fertilizers here and increase the food. And I will add this one because it stops fire. So food. Maybe I need to add other types here. Legume. Oh, now that I have more uh, biodiversity and prosperity, I can hear the uh, sound of the birds. That's, that's very, very nice. I like it. Okay, let's see. Uh, here we have some fertilizers already. It's maybe a strategic decision to plant something here. And also biodiversity here. Then maybe use this land. Okay, uh, let's do this. Okay, your forest has significant value for the local community. So that is another comment maybe from my side that when I finished the game, I stopped losing, I stopped seeing the indicators. And um, I would have loved to see the indicators again um, to understand because I completely, like, I remember that the indicators were doing much better this time, but I don't remember where they were standing. Uh, so I really like to, to see that. The diversity of your forest is medium. This means that the, some animals are not now are now living in the forest. It captures around uh, 198 tons of CO2 per year. Have a look at the Mustang uh, Foundation. Um, I would say that in the second round, because of my familiarity with the game, I really perform better and I'm more happy with my performance. But I would say that is built on what I learned through the struggles. Of the first round so again well done i really like the game uh and i learned a lot see you in the next video and go to my foundation